This is actually a different game I was going to play today. Um, it was a Minecraft mod, actually, that was very... I was very intrigued, but it looked very complicated to install. And it was already, like, 12 p.m., so I was like, you know what? Maybe I'll just... Maybe I'll worry about this all the time. Um, I'm going to shrink chat. Cool. It's exactly what I was trying to click on. Just so it's not... Yeah. It doesn't take up too much space. I don't know why! This is the game, this is the game right? Right, Luca, that you want me to play? And that Blind Sauce claimed it was one of the best games he's played in a very long time or something. Or most unique or something like that. I don't know. Uh, so I don't really know anything about this. So this will be interesting. Does everything look okay? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Kills a stupid fishing text log. Mobius. Yes, and I love it. A planet. Uh, I'm very. This scares me. So we're gonna name ourselves Spoop. How does the controller work? It works! Is the game really loud? How loud is the game? One if the game's too loud. Two if it's too quiet. Three if it's perfect. I'm gonna just turn it down a little bit. Preemptively. All right, now let me know if it's too loud or too quiet. New expedition. Spoopy boopy. Wake up! Grab a bunch of little makeup. I already forgot what the next one was. Uh oh, what is it? This feels like Subnautica. What the? F oh, hello. Ooh. This already feels like Firewatch a little bit. Is this related to Firewatch? Am I blue? Oh no, I'm blue. I'm Jake Sully. Wait. Hello. Let the pilot. Back for the point last camp on the star of my feet. So it's lunch day, eh? Why is Canadian? It's lunch day, eh? Seems like only yesterday you joined the space program and suddenly here you are, leaving you on your first solo voyage. What do you say? Are you ready to get this beauty off the ground? It's all feeling ready to go. I'm ready if you are. Are you kidding? Of course I'm ready. It's finally I thought it was a solo mission, what? It's finally time to cut the new landing. Hydraulic will pilot the auto flight system. If you pilot, make sure you don't cross the set the first time put it down. You hear? Hey, well, you'll need to get the launch codes from hard fares at the observatory before you can lift off. Just bring those, just bring those here once you said your goodbyes or whatever. Okay. Roast marshmallows. Mm. Bet it! <laughs> oh, it's just gone. <laughs> what? Pulse. We gotta do this. Alright. Oh, can I turn it? Uh -huh. Wait. Ooh, it's getting nice and brown. Ah, that just scared me. Eat it! Nom, 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 nom. Nom, nom, Oh, flu bursting. <laughs> Not having taken thought, are you? Uh, I don't want to read all that. Try to read all that. Um, three? It's perfect. Okay, awesome. Um,. Wait, Logan, I think I spammed the lyrics to Guns and Ships in Space Discord a few days ago. No, you're just from the Blue Man Group of the Universe. Oh, that makes sense. Oh my god. Ah! It bombs us! It bombs us! Wait, what did that say? Did you see that? Like a bar popped up. Please let me know if at any point this game gets too loud and you can't really understand what I'm saying or something. Alright, thank you. Or if too quiet, too. We have life is this music gives me life is strange vibes. Hey, it's morning. Whoa. Fly model ship. Oh shit! Ah, ah. Hey, we've done it. Uh, uh, how do I? How do I go up? And it's nighttime again. Um. Oh, thrust up and down. Got it. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Mayday, mayday! We got casualties! <laughs> oh, oh, we 
We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We Gucci. We Gucci. Maybe. Oh! All right. We're fine. We're fine. Ow! <laughs> Can we do anything with this? Oh, shit. Whoa! Who's this? Oh, I wasn't messing around with anything at all. Wait. Oh, leave. There you go. Mika. Well, this is like... Uh, like the time the external fuel tanks explode at re-entry. You'll, you'll be okay fighting the big one, right? <laughs> no, dude. Are you kidding me? Huh? We're all dead already. We're dead right now. Oh, we have like a village. I thought we were like camping or something. Um, burnt marshmallow don't taste so bad. I don't like burnt anything. Hey, hatchling. Are you leaving us to seek an adventure amongst the stars when you return? Let's me, you, and Gozen open up the bottle of the good stuff. Uh, we're only seeking adventure amongst one star, actually. All those stars are too far away. The good stuff is less delicious to sap wine and more. Don't think I just have challenge here. No matter if I ruined the name of scientific accuracy. Nevertheless, I do hope you enjoy your travels. Good luck. Good. What is with these clouds, dude? Is it nighttime already? Wait, is it really night already? Ah! How is that lantern still on? 0 out of 10 game is not realistic. Lantern should be off. Yay, one of my favorite Animal Crossing streams is playing. One of my favorite Animal Crossing streamers is playing for time in a week tomorrow. She went on vacation. Playing is playing for time in a week? What does that mean? Hello, old timer. Hey, hey, hey. over the thing, eh? Uh, they don't really explode as often as you know. So the odds of survival are statistically quite high. Yes, we can probably come along. Well, I should probably thank you for causing a few flash fires in your precipices. By the way, good luck with the retro rocket. Okay. Projector is linked with our sky shutter satellite. Is this not important, Luca? Satellite is equipped with two onboard cameras. See if you can take a snapshot of our village. This is a very small planet we live on, apparently. So it explains why night and day are so quick. Is there a run button? There's a slow button. Marl! Well, nothing. Oh, hell's gonna miss you. Speaking of launch day, I was thinking about it, and the platform those ships large from is getting old. It's about time we build a new one, a less flammable one. The big tree in the forest. For choice, I might help you out. Space, let me just say the word. Uh, launch planet is flammable. Hi, you didn't realize that? Don't worry, it's held up and launches so far. It'll definitely be fine for yours, probably. True. Put it on side. Nope. Some of it. Hello there, Space Cadet. Here, leaving for the crater today. If any of you meet any other travelers up there, remind me to take proper care of their instruments, won't you? Where's the observatory? It's a question like that that make us worry about you going out of space on your own, you know? I'm sorry, just up the path behind the waterfall. There's a couple of signs marking the way, but really, if you just keep going up and look and hook a right, you'll get the zumminim. The Observatory. I gotta know. Behind the waterfall, eh? Did I die? No. Hello? Hello? Oh shit, I'm lost. Uh oh. <laughs> there you are. I can't take this. The pressure's too high. I'm gonna drown myself. Uh oh. Am I stuck? No. Launch tower. This game looks nice. It does look very nice, don't it? Hello, astronauts. Uh, if it is my favorite troublemaker. We want to play hide and seek, but Moraine won't let us borrow their signal scope because it's really delicate and not supposed to be thrown around like that. Hey, 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 can we use your signal scope? Can we? Can we please? Sure. Woohoo! Okay, here are the rules. Galena and I will hide with these radios and use your signal scope to find us. Last one to be found wins. Okay, close your eyes and start counting. I said close your ears. <laughs> the, the two. Hey, that's why I walked to the fire that made a weird noise. Oh. This is 
kind of cool. So what do I do now? I just follow it? Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Alright, how do I get back up there? How do I get back up there? Kid, I'm gonna kick the shit out of you when I find you, kid. I have a single scope and I have no idea how to use it. Ooh. Alright, this one seems like it might be easier. Is he behind the waterfall? That's really funny. No, he's like up. No. So with like an Australian accent. No. Oh. I don't even get over there. Fish and rhyme, fish and rhyme. Singing helps and pass time. In the crib. Well, yes, it'll be a little busier with the other round. Ten damn. That's a big water planting. John seat. That's where I'd go. I need to find horned hell. Did you try the observatory? Literally, I remember. Parkour, parkour! Hello, you little shit. Oh, you found me, but my high saw us here, good. Don't forget to find us both, okay? Oh. Oh. Hello. I won. I'm happy. Thanks for playing with us. Oh, you disgusting little creature, you. Oh, I, I keep it. Interesting. All right, observatory. Still can't run. Scoop, scoop, scoop. Zero G cave. Ooh. Yeah, I get I get very um, Firewatch vibes from this game so far. I see you poking through. This tree looks terrible. Sorry. I've been playing rehydrated so much and noticing like everything clipping through everything else. Which really bugged me. Hey, come on, your old flight coach, pro you launch. I've got I've got zero G training if you want a refresher. Yeah, let's do it. Hey, I thought I might see you before the big launch. Never getting the better nerves getting the better of you. Um Right, like you were nervous for a first flight. Hey, don't worry about it. Your nerves are between you, me, and the vast endless of space. Ha 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 ha. But really, you'll do fine out there. I'd worry more about that ship if I were you. Hopefully that lunatic slay at least fixed the retro rocket. So, listen, there's a satellite, which definitely is not a piece of broken mining equipment. Set up down there in the Geo -Z Zero G cave and these repairs. If you're looking for the last minute Zero G practice, head down to lift and into the cave. Or don't, as long as you're confident enough to make the ship repairs. One repair satellite coming up. Cool, get it. Get to it and try not to concuss yourself for your first one. I was not really paying attention. What, what am I doing? Some of a satellite. Wait, what's your three mean, Logan? Oh, does that mean you're third and cheering? Ah, uh, that's why you cheered, huh? I see. Well, definitely not zero G. There's less G, but... Was it the moon with the one-sixth of the gravity? That feels more accurate. Why is that... <laughs> Why do these barrels have propellers on them? At least that one did. Oh, I'm not even in there yet. Mm. Oh, this is interesting. We got some miners in here, huh? I know it's drop down. I'm getting some zero touchy time. Give me the dirt! Some fresh dirt. Not much happening in here. Let me think. Come think of it. Tech tight. <laughs> nice little reference. So I saw something like crash outside of the village or crater. That's new and different. Oh, hey, about that. Yeah, they were on Firewatch last night. I thought. I like the thought of Ailing being less advanced than us. Were the advanced. Yeah, I've. I've Ow. I've always thought that was a possibility too. Like we're just we're, the reason why I haven't met any aliens because we're actually somehow managed to be the most, ad, uh, you know, advanced. They're on Firewatch with this old scout launcher and saw smoke, so they went to check it out. Safety first, right? Now I'm kidding. I said that's a tech that one's pretty rude. How long are they left for? If you ask me. Cool. Oh, I 
don't have to worry about fuel. What am I doing? Go! Do you have to be repaired? Holy shit. What? Alright, ow. Lock on. Uh. This is very strange. Holy crap, this feels very awkward. Am I damaging myself? With X? Sad I know. Ayo! Oh, no, no, no. Where even am I? <laughs> am I going up or down right now? I don't know. I'm going up. Okay, so I just came from. I see. What the hell is that? I want it. Roll. Oh, it's a lantern. I see. Uh. Yeah, it's not a very good flashlight. Go this way? Wait, what the hell? I'm so confused. I'm so... Holy shit. I am so lost. You'll get used to it. Oh. I'm expect Oh, so they're like all here? No, oh, dude. It's... I pre... What? Hold A to match velocity. Same matched. Oh, let me repair it. What? Won't let me do anything. Oh, there, I had to get closer, I see. It was like very weird. This is very, very strange. 50% field rate. Uh oh. I see flashing, so that's probably right here, right? Or it's... What? Wait, what? Uh... Dude, this is so confusing. Where is it? I have like no fuel left. I'm at like one fourth. How am I already used so much? Dude, I'm so confused. Too far away. Yeah. Oh! No, 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 no. Up. I'm so screwed. How did Vinny do on this part? Stop, 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 stop. Dude, it's so confusing. You gotta hold so many different buttons. I need to get closer. There it is. Uh -huh. Excellent. Okay, just gotta get with like zero fuel. It's fine. Uh -huh. I just, I just have no idea where I am or anything. <laughs> Dude, there's no way. I'm not getting out of this. There's no way. I have no idea where the hell I'm going. Critical fuel. I don't even know where, I, where did I come from. Where did I go? Where did I come from? Con I Joe. You also had some issues? Interesting. Stop, stop, stop using fuel. How do I get back? Probably up, right? Oh, is this? Oh, we're just leaving now. Ah. Well, that worked out. That was uh, not easy. Woo! How long is this game? Let's see here.
How long to beat Outer Wilds? Let's see here. I'm curious. I, I don't think Vinny streamed it for very long. Hello, where's my reward? Nicely done. Of course, it'll be a little more stressful when you're hurling through big space. Just remember that you're training and trying to get hit with anything big. I see. I can see that you're itching to get off this rock, so hit. So go get the launch codes from the observer train. Get out of here already. Best of luck out there. And hey, try to avoid getting yourself killed. I put so much time in the train. Is that right? What? Huh? I did not press that. Why? Focus camera. Who's even taking pictures of? So weird. <laughs> Danger. Inside the fence is a pocket of ghost matter. Oh, a strange and dangerous substance that invisible naked eye. The good news you can detect is oh, I should have read that first. Around 20 minutes? Around tell you out a while is around 20 minutes. I'll be extremely lucky if you do. No, no, no. I'm Huh? I saw the. How long did it be here? Let's see. I'm, I'm just curious. 20 hours? Damn, completion is 21 hours. Uh, moving through ghost matter is uniquely painful and, you'll, and it will probably kill you. Don't like, complain to me if you're fooling around. Ah! Hey. Hi, astronaut! You know the path of the ghost matter inside this fence? Goes and said it used to be bigger when they were hatchling. Wait, what? Said it used to be bigger when they were hatchling? Huh? Because ghost matter evaporates. Oh, I see. It just takes a su 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 super, super long time to go away. Oh, there's still ghost matter in the village where I'm a girl. Well, ghost matter is awesome. Ghost matter is super cool. It'll burn the heck out of you. You shouldn't be throwing rocks in there. Ghost matter is dangerous. You know, you know ghost matter is how Tectite lost their foot, right? Well, really? That is so cool. True. Luca, wait, what? Looks like Vinny five streams, but he's also very good too. Spoiler, Jesus. What, to know you can be in 20 minutes? That's not a spoiler. Just, even if so, out of context spoilers like that, like you freaking out about me finding out, I would say that's much more of a spoiler um, than me, than me, like, just playing that. Like, to me, when I read that, that means you can speed this game in 20 minutes. But you freaking out... Like that pretty much tells me that oh there there's more to that than I thought. So technically you spoiled me, Luca. <laughs> As I smoke from the young bark crater up north and figured I should go check it out. You could use this scout launchers. Please don't bring it while I'm gone. I'm gonna lose it when I'm gone. Hello. Mm -hmm. Oh hello astronaut. This is good weather for your launch, right? That's lucky. What are you up to? I'm going to use my signal scope to pick up sounds from distant planets. I s it's set to the Outer Wilds Ventures frequency so I can pick up the Traveler's Mute. Last night, I heard Rebex Banjo come into the Bristol Hollow. I hope that means they're safe. I can hear different planets, too. It depends on what time of day it is or since different planets are up in the sky for a different time. Signal scopes are cool. You're cool. Hey, it's fake moon. It's getting farther away. Is there anything else? Ooh. Our wild frequency, hide and seek. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. You can do different frequencies like that. <laughs> Do 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 do. You're gonna expect spoilers if you're watching. Let's ha ha. Oops. No, I tell what he meant, Kelly. He knows this game. He watched Vine Sauce play it. Uh, okay. Uh, didn't expect that. I'm trying to take a snapshot, but don't let me. Retrieve. Oh. Sorry, I'm an idiot. What am I supposed to do with this shit? This game's very confusing so far. Northwest Geyser Mountain. Is that... Okay, that's that. Got it. Okay. 
Okay. What the hell's the observatory? Ah, boom. Wait, there's a reverse camera too? What do we got here? Craters? Because guess what? I'm your favorite VIP one. Why am I only VIP? Yeah, it's true. I'm tired. Help. Go sleepy time. It's sleepy time. It's goofy time. Rotate camera. Interesting. Quantum Grover Crater. Okay. No my all ruins. So far, I'm not really enjoying this game very much. I'm going to lie. The fat thing with a giant telescope? Ah, oh, right there, I see. Ooh. Is that it? Yep. Yep. I went the wrong way this entire time. Are you kidding me? Wait, how did he say this was good? I was supposed to like, launch myself or something? I don't know. Now, is there fall damage? There is. I broke my legs. Hooray! Finally. A tree house. What is this shitty made house? Dude, come on. I could build a better house than this. It's literally a lean-to. Lean-two, lean-three, lean-four. The thing is a bit slow. Okay. I'll trust that it picks up then. Our wilds, ventures, founding members, clockwise swap up, Hornfells, Golden, Slade, and Feldspar. Feldspar. Big thanks to the additional founding members of Outer Wilds Ventures with all the way to go on the ground. Matthew Schneider, Baron. Okay, these are real people. This is their. Uh, oh no. <laughs> ah! Patreon peeps. Supporters. Um, Outer Wilds Ventures, Timber Hertz, first and only space program, was founded to explore the far reaches of the solar system. Feld Spa was the first. Heard the end to be internationally launched in space. They completed the first orbit around Timber Hearth and later made the first of what would be many lines on the moon, the Adarok. Hello. Hi, hi, it's your favorite ish. It's my favorite ish. I'll oh, stay away, huh, buddy? It's the, tra it's the translator tools inaugural flight, too. I'm so excited. It's making me nauseous. Just think, you'll be able to translate my any nail. No, my text you are anywhere you are. The two of us are put hours in the vending that tool, so I'll break it, okay? Well, do, do not break it. Look, ignore me, okay? I'm just nervous. Um, Not even the one going to space. How are you feeling? I'm excited. Good. Uh, you've been waiting for this day since your hash. I can't wait for you to see all that payoff. Uh, so, what's the dirt? You see how the nail my statues are. You here to see the new no may statue? Of course. Huh, I knew you'd want to see it before you headed off. Hornfell just finished pe pe uh, prepping for the display. The amazing, isn't it? Makes me wish you could see how real life Nomai looks like. I guess, but I guess this is as close we'll ever get. Check it out. Looks like that for a first weird. Uh, this is first fully attack that you ever found, you know. Look how old it is. It's in great shape. Oh, geez, got all carried away. Go on. Have ship launch. Take care of yourself. Are you here? This remarkably intact statue was carved by the Nomais, an ancient species who dwell in our solar system thousands of years ago. The statue provided us with our most detailed look at the Nomai, who just appeared to have been covered with a layer of fur. Note, note the lack of decorative jewelry had been covered in fur. Although their artifacts and structures have been found on almost every planet in the solar system, we hope to have, we have no idea how the species came from or what happened to them. It would be cool if it was just a human. You know? Wait, maybe it is. Their head's like bowed down. I can't really, wait, no, you can see like a face though. Or is that like jewelry? Hmm. Yeah, so I have no idea what the hell's going on. And it's not, it, it's not very captivating to me yet. I'm counting on it that it will get better. Oh, teleporting. Tindrock moving around in the grotto appears direct to conscious observation. The level headed among us realize that there must be some sort of illusion at play. 
But Ga Gabbro claims rock exists on all possible states until it's observed. Well, that means whatever is actually happening, both sides debate, agree, the effect was extremely creepy. Wait, so can I jump to here? Cool. So what happens if I jump on top of it? And then I take my eyes off it. Come on. You know you wanna. Come on. Ah! Come on! Huh. No! Fuck off! Sorry, I give up. <laughs> Stars like our salt and generate light and heat by fusing hydrogen and helium. As it grows older, the star runs out of hydrogen and starts to contrast. As the star's core as the star's core contracts, it gets hotter, causing the outer layers to expand. The star's become a red giant. When the core is hot enough, it starts to fuse helium into carbon. If the star is massive enough, when it continues to fuse carbon into heavier elements like iron, ultimately the star will collapse until under its own gravity and then explode into a violently called supernova. Based on Church's observation, this will one to be the fate of our own star. So why, like, this is from the Blanche Ball thing. Why can't they walk over here? So it's taking a nome at Brittle Hollow. It seems to create a local gravity distortion that's likely used to traverse steep surfaces. Try it out. Ch -ch 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 -try. Oh, definitely not a tutorial for later or anything. Haha. -ha. Nome technology brought back from space. An astronaut has been a great boon to our outer wilds adventure. Um, a list to modify expedition gear and exciting explorers. For example, a little scout now boasts a warp retrieval capabilities, allows astronauts to recall their scouts almost immediately, or instantly, and this has drastically reduced the number of scouts lost in the depths of space. And I'm starting to wonder if, like, humans are the, uh, this, um, Nome peep, their species. When, what you're, what you see here is the Nome skeleton. We can tell by the skulls that possess antlers, okay, and quite unnaturally, only three eyes. <laughs> The Nome body was likely adapted for a living exclusively on land. The differences in Nome anatomy, such as their shockingly fragile bone structure, show us that he Herthians couldn't have descended from Nomanian ancestry. It's not clear where the Nome originated from or why they disappeared. We hope to find more clues as a puzzle to explore ourselves. I think this is very relevant to us. Aside from dwelling and the structures they built, the Nome also made our this decorated pole. Pottery was discovered on Brittle Hollow. Some ancient nomad art depicts strange animals, so, uh, foreign celestial objects, and other objects that can't be found in our solar system. Which makes us wonder whether the nomad originates elsewhere in the universe or simply had vibrant imaginations. Were the nomad born in our solar system, or were they born among other stars, planets? If so, if so how and where did they come from? There are just many questions to be answered through the, the expeditions. I'm not even gonna try that word. <laughs> It looks pretty. Also, I can't wait for Friday. I also can't wait for Mineral Town. Yeah, I'm excited for Mineral Town, too. I I bought that game today, and, um, yeah, I'll, I'll play it on Tuesday if I can. Please know me writing. So it was essential to deciphering their unique language. All this text is linear. The know my text off the branches off the central port. <sighs> Interestingly, each branch tends to be written by a different author. Kasava, we're nearly ready. Felix and I only have finished uh, construction. Fel Felix. Um, and says collaborating device won't take long. Fortunately, the outer rocks. Wait, was it more converted? Fortunately, the outer rocks lack of atmosphere will make calibration simple. After all this time, I'm thrilled to finally resume our search. Or is it more? Okay, that doesn't say anything apparently. Good to know. Alright, is that it? That yeah, was this shit. So, so these balls move on their own. They're not perfect level. So, what do you think causes spooky motion? The answer is the moon. As, the planet, as, our or, as it orbits our planet, outer rocks gravity pulls an object from different directions. In fact, it's pulling it right now. Cool. Oh, so it'll be kind of like a clock in this world. That's neat.
sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Uh, I'll take you. I'm going to send you. Hourglass Twins. Oh, there's another thing here. What's this? Hmm. Brittle Hollow. You are the rich. Timber Hearth. Giant's Deep. And. Dog Bramble! Everyone loves Dog Bramble. There you are. Just finished the pre flight observations. The local conditions are good. Time to get a new session off the ground. And you'll be our first session. I've ever with no no my translator tool. I confess, I've been giddy all day just thinking about it. We're better equipped than ever to unravel the mysteries of the way. You and Hal should really try to work. Ah, tell me, what do you? What's your plan on the space? I'm gonna run with no my. I'll meet up with other travelers. I wanna go somewhere no one's gone before. I think I'll start with something small. I'm gonna wing it. Plan to follow in the footsteps of Feldspar and the Great Outer Wild Adventure Church. Are you? I might have guessed. Well, if he's if you can't pull that translator tool of yours to good use while you're out of there, then, well then, looks like all stuff for you to send you off. All in all, it's a fine day. I'm ready to get this wrong. I'm ready to die in space. That's why you'll be needing the launch codes then. Here they are. Best uh, get off the ground before Slate makes any modifications to your ship, eh? If you're out there, let me know if I can help you with anything. Launch all. I better not have to remember that crap. <gasps> An anglerfish. Anglerfish specimen was found to be attached to lion gear of one of our ships uh, that flew closer to Bramble. It appears well suited to living in a dark places with minimal atmosphere. Hmm. A hint, perhaps. The stream I watched had early access to some things. Uh, yeah, there's been a few streamers that had early access. I know, um. Oh, fuck. Uh, what's her face? Oh, I can't. Whoa. Okay, cool. Hello. Lunch. Lunch. No, this way. Okay. I heard you get a look at that no may statue. This statue looking at me with my eyes. Whoa, the statue's doing what? Uh, I know Peanut Butter Game Gamer had had an early code, and also someone else. What the hell is she called though? All the other guys, Misha Crossing for some reason. What the hell is her name? That's gonna really bug me. It starts with an F, like Fishu or something like that. Hmm. I don't know. Um. So it's eyes open. And you just saw images of your own memories glowing, lights flying around. You mean like a hallucination? There's no offense, but are you sure you're okay? Launching, like, medically speaking. You know what? Don't worry about it. I know that's you definitely weird. I mean, if you're saying it happened, then I guess it did. But why? Horn fellas try everything. You got the statue's eyes open. And definitely, yeah. Try everything at the statue's eyes open. What? <laughs> I don't think it's ever like this ever happened to them. I don't think you're going to get any answers from the museum statue. But Gabriel said they were trying to get back to the giant Zeep. I don't know what trying it on, though. Maybe they'd tell you more. On the other hand, Gabriel's, you know, Gabriel. I don't know who the hell Gabriel is, dude. So maybe you're better off searching for more for, you know, geez, now I'm really jealous if you go into space. Hey, see if you can use our translator tool to find more information about the statue. Okay, good luck and safe flying. I'm not gonna look it for that. I don't know what that means. This is definitely gonna kill me, huh? Uh, We're fine. I didn't mean to fall down here, though. Well, yeah, what was the streamer you're watching with that, Kayla? I'd, I'd be curious to know. Gamma yeah, Vine, I guess, was the dude like way up top. Up on a rooftop. Bam, bam, bam. Am I going the right place? Lunch tower! There's no jumping. Wait, what's this way? It's back to the campsite. Aim's a bit slow, huh? Being very slow, I think. That's slate. 
Good way for Teo. The excitement of new lunch is fun and all, but I can't wait to get back to work on the ship. We're making, we're working on fixing all pods, avoidance system for this one. Oh, sorry. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm a universe. No, I never heard of him. This streamer, I watched play it early. Cool. That begins the fun part. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. I'm ending the stream. I'm just kidding. <laughs> ha, check you. Ha, ha. Anything cool up here? It's made out of wood. That's funny. I don't know if I want to look at this or not. One only heard of the end village, as well as the main source of explosions on this planet. And though my statue of the tree opened its eyes and looked at me, I saw strange glowing lights and my own memories flashed before my eyes. Um, Hal says the statue has never opened its eyes before, despite Horde Fell's best efforts. A cave at the very center of Timber Hearth, used by Outer Wilds Ventures to train new astronauts. I, su I successfully repaired the satellite for gold. Wait, there's a moon? The normally text in the observatory talks about calibrating some sort of device on Outer Rock. Hal says Gabbro went back to Giant Steep to try and learn more about Naomi Stepson. Okay, so Gabbro is in on this planet. Gotcha. Cool. All right. Sit up. Oh, the fuel's full. Oh, no. I don't like games. You have to like worry about fuel and stuff all the time. That shit's annoying. Uh, lift off. Huh? Oh. Uh. Oh fuck. Um. What the fuck? I expected a loading What the fuck? I expected a loading screen, not... Uh. What do you do about? Going towards destination. Yeah, I expected a loading screen, not... All right, fly to space. <laughs> what the hell, it's crazy. How do I go on? Control pilot. What do I do? Do I get out? Unbuckle. Can I go go to it? Return suits. <laughs> Open hatch. Yeah, this is a small moon, alright. I'm dead! I'm dead! No! Land on it? How? Cool. Don't you dare put me on this fucking planet, I swear to God. God damn it. Did, did I just die? Well, bad dreamer told me you look half asleep. There's negative on being distressed. I know that you just sleep out under your stars before a night before a launch. Big ass me, it makes you a bit jumpy. Shuffle one of the moon. Hold up, we're gonna get off launch codes from the director first. Oh, yeah. From, uh. Oh, must be inhaling more fiends. I realize this stuff is potent. Well, I've got the codes. No one's gonna stop you. Good luck and take care of the ship. Alright. Bleep, 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 bleep. I tell you, Bo gave me her photo twice. That that's normal. Right, let's go. Suit on up. Buckle on up. All right, how do I lift off landing camera? Let's see what this looks like from this angle this time. Cool. Really? All right, where's Out Rock at? Dude, this is actually really cool. 
Is that it? Oh. Just fucking go. How do I land? Is it any farther away? Digital power. Scout launcher. I don't understand. It's getting closer to me, so that's good. Oh. Tiny mode. Am I on it? Hey, look at that. Everything's great. Check it out, even. Hello. Wait, there's stuff on here, it said, right? It's funny how small this is. <laughs> I like how that first flight did not last very long at all. Good stuff. There's a fire signal nearby. Got some trees hanging out. All right. Trees and technology and chamber filled. Oh, neat. How do I get in here? Let me in. Let me in. You're under arrest. You're under arrest for me, little bitch. Holy poo. Fire control to tell me a lot. She's long time no see. Actually, I guess it's been a long time since I've seen anyone. Do all of her travels come by? Little rifles. So I'm going to try it back from the ships. Well, let's get to the Need more frequent repairs. Nowadays, mostly use that. You set of eyes on things. Some. Something church you comes sometimes church comes by and says hi, but Gabriel's Gabriel, and you know how Reback feels about unnecessary space fight. Don't go. Uh, I mean, what else? Anything else seems only up here. A little. I'm in touch with Gang Control. One Fallon goes in mostly, and they radio up chat now and then. And then when the Gang Control forgets I'm up here, which not that they usually do, and wait, and they usually do, I launch by a little scout in the village. You spy on us? What? No, it's not spying. It's it's one way communication. That none of the villagers know about because I've never told them. Don't go. Uh, what was that you're whistling? Probably, or, or actually, definitely. The other travelers carry instruments so they don't bother whistling. You can pick up their music with a signal scope, you know. Best ball for them is the North Pole. Great reception. North Pole is marked near the map, but the outer rock is pretty small moon. Just realize go north. They can't miss it. Don't go. Um, what is this place? Ha, <laughs> very far. Let's start. Oh, stars above your stairs, aren't you? That's just depressing. Uh -huh. Welcome to Lunar Outpost, which apparently the space program doesn't bother to teach you about anymore. When we first opened up out of wilds, travelers used to bring their ships here all the time for repair. The lost space fan technology has improved loads since then, but the older ships tend to uh, fall apart a lot, like more than they do now. The outputs cut down, the numbers of launches and landers take place in the village, and also the numbers of fires. Nowadays, though, it's mostly... Just me up here, raising the saplings of timber hearth and keep an eye on things. Uh, okay. Oh, so is this where all the trees come from? Ship? Oh, that's where my ship is, I see. Can I go in? Refuel the jetpack. I don't really need that. No, may as well, yes. Nearby? Alright, what am I supposed to be doing here? Up and down movement. Use the signal scope to identify unknown signals. Okay. So, I guess. Ask her. Oh, so is that it? Gravity well here or something? I can't. I can't go. So, is this the North Pole? I have no idea. SK signal 
scope log. Day 48, someone picking up Ryback's banjo from Bristol Hollow. I'm sure they're fine, but I'll feel better once I can hear the music. Day 51, listen to Chirp play for a while today. Unrelated, someone should tell Porphy and goes in that their flirting is not subtle from an aerial perspective. Banjo music coming a lot and clear today. Sounds like Ryback's doing okay. Oh, if I was worried, day 63, I thought I heard something strange. I don't know, it's probably nothing. Day 70, no, it's back in today. Something strange coming from Timber Hearth. Okay, I know it's crazy, but the sounds from Timber Hearth sounds exactly like Feldspar's harmonica, but Feldspar disappeared in space ages ago. Can't be them. Day, it's still here. This is creepy. Maybe my signal scope is broken. I better talk to Ganesh. Harmonica? that is that her marker beautiful absolutely beautiful oh damn y'all want a party huh Interesting thing, like, what the hell is that? Um, is there anything else? Like, is there anything I should be looking for? The HUD indicates the poles. Yeah, I, I can see that now. I figured that meant that. Oh! Uh, what the fuck? I didn't expect this. Oh, dude. Oh, they're recording. Church knows property of church. As an old crater, the neat thing here is that the composition of samples I took from the impact site matches the composition of the ice out in the outskirts of Dark Bramble. I posted the outer rock was hit by a piece of a planet that used to be where Dark Bramble now lies. To follow up, maybe there are more fragments of the old planet Dark Bramble destroyed and other astral bodies in our solar system. Just explore and chat to die. Okay. Easy. I wish there was better lighting. I can't really tell what the hell I'm doing. I'm a bit low on oxygen. Map. Hey, look at that. Wait, what? This is, I didn't realize there's another planet like that nearby. Oh, it's bright again. Is there like a different signal or anything? No. Alright, I'm falling. Probably go back to my ship. <laughs> is that my ship? What is this? Ship. Oh my god. Oopsies. Hit the ground running. Back to the rules when I hit the ground running. Hit the ground running. Hit the ground running. Hit the ground running and I hit the ground running. 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 Uh oh, I reset everything. Oh man. Let's go to the south pole. Okay, turn on my flashlight. Almost at 2k points. Don't annoy me. Don't you know me if I were you? I don't know what's at 2k. I don't remember anything to be honest. Ooh, ruins. Come on. Ooh, ooh, I see puzzles. Ooh. Yeah, screw dude. Sure. Wait, what the hell is this? What the fuck is this? Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Huh? What the hell? Um. Yeah, I have no clue what's going on.
gonna try the other ones. How do I get it out? Huh? Control of my camera. The sun. The sun. The sun. I don't know exactly what that accomplishes, though. Okay. Maybe I launch this through here. I don't know, dude. Is it just a map? What's that 2k points? I don't want to click on it. I think it's just a map. Does that go home? Something though. Bye bye. Uh oh, I just do an uh oh. Careful! God damn it! These controls are very weird. I, I'm not a big fan of these controls. Flying around is very difficult. Hey. I don't know. I keep expecting me to like scan stuff or something, but nope, can't do that. Get some oxygen while we're here. Surprised it didn't murder me because I touched something at two feet a second. Do we have any updated dialogue with you? Uh, nope. Very funny. Those stars, you should. No! I hit B because I thought that exited the conversation. No! Oh, you gotta say bye. Talk to you later. Where my ship has at it, yes. Can I tell you when you miss stuff? Yeah, sure. If there's something else I can do on the moon, then let me know, because I don't know where else to go. I'm just gonna leave, but there's a, so else, if there's other things I can do, then yeah, you let me know where to go, I guess. I'm guessing it has something to do with this. Oh! Alright. Uh, untranslated writing. Yep. I was upstairs testing the eye signal locator, and it and I could hear and follow signals from the sun. Giants deep and brittle hollow. Wow. They call the same things we do. Interesting. Oh, Sorry, my sock fell off. I'm trying to put it back on. It's not going on! Like caught! What the hell? That's caught on my own foot. Ah! What? Oh. What the fuck? What the fuck? I don't get it. Wait, is this entrance? What the hell? What? I don't fucking get it, dude. What? How do I translate it? Aim translator. R. Cool. Yep. Remove scroll. Oh. Huh? But I didn't translate it at all. The purple. The purple's untranslated? Oh, I'm an idiot. Uh, however, something strange is happening when I ask the eye signal locator to follow the eye signal. The device's indicator rotates wildly or never points in just one direction. I see. Most likely calibrated the locator incorrectly. Privy my apprentice and I will make more adjustments to try again. 
An update, disappointingly, everything is all correctly calibrated after all. Sometimes we need to post this, but my friends and I believe we need to build a more sophisticated device if we want to find the exact location of the eye of the universe. It's the eye of the spider! Uh, Thatch. Then we will build it. Don't lose hope. Um, oh, Casanova, our search for the eye is what brought us to this planet in the first place. We won't give up so easily. This is a curious result. It's possible the eye has stopped calling out its signal. Do I need this? Do I want the scroll? I was upstairs testing the eye signal locator and I could hear it follow the signals from the sun, the giant's deep, and brittle hollow. Oh. It's the same stuff. I see. So maybe as we get more scrolls, we bring it here. Oh, there's already a scroll in there. Let's see. Let's put that. Wait, am I crazy? I thought there's two scroll holes there. Or should this new, more sophisticated in locator be built that may be larger than the ice single locator is for? The Southern Glacier on Brittle Hollow has ample available space. I could construct a new building to house this proposed locator. Too close to target. Yes, let's build there. I imagine our young friend Connie would enjoy this that immensely. He's always held a great interest in the eye, especially for a child born so long after the crash. I will plan construction on Brittle Hollow South Pole immediately. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna remember that. Brittle Hollow South Pole. I, by the time I moved away and it disappeared, I had already forgotten. <laughs> Anona and those of us originally stranded there, an Ember Twin built a quantum moon locator there. I'm not gonna remember this. Too much shit to remember. The Ember Twin built a quantum moon locator there. But the heat of the sun made its construction challenging. I wouldn't recommend building on that planet. Do I gotta remember that? Don't worry. It will all go to your ship out? Okay, thanks, Luca. That, that's, that's very good to know. Ooh. Okay, wow. I've seen this room in other travelers' pictures, but seeing it for myself. It's really old, isn't it? Wow, this is the coolest day of my life. Okay, um, time for some official notes. This is some kind of nomad locator. I can point out different planets, which is incredibly cool, by the way. But from what I can understand of the writing here, I think it was both trying to find something specific. I'm not sure. I was able to translate something about the South Pole of Brittle Hollow, so I'll fly there and see if we can learn more. Yep, just gotta go back to the old ship, take off. Totally safe. Most safe all the stars above. Hey, the stars above. Uh, have I missed anything else, Luca, or am I good to go now? Do, 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 do. Where am I ship at? It's standing. Good. Oh, I should jump first. That's how I should. Can't see. I can't see. I'm gonna die, dude. <laughs> It's definitely meant a jump and then. Oh, fuck. I'm dead, aren't I? Match velocity. <gasps> okay, so that. Okay, so that's how you're supposed to do that. Okay, so into the pool, and the director of my drama club sometimes goes there. And I didn't want to see him. I said, let's hope he's not there because you know that incident with the awards. And he was there. I don't know the incident with the awards. I forget. I'm sorry. We have bad memory. Cool. All right, so uh, I want to go back to my planet and like land in a different spot, but we won't do that. Where's everything? 
The sun. Can we fly into the sun? <laughs> that sounds great. Alright, let's see what we got here. I like how they have a locator for other planets. You know, you can just see them all. Where the hell is everything? Hello? You can see on the everything below up there. Um, I'm trying to see a map. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the. Well, I'm just gonna fly and hopefully some pops up. You know. Oh, hello. Like you. Lights off. I land on this. Oh, I got a bad feeling. <laughs> Ah, the sign! The sign! No, the sign! Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, no! I didn't know it sucked me in like that! I fucking died! <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> so much of this doesn't remember. Let's see all of it. Hello. Where does that go? There's no map, right? No, there's not. Hello. Let's fly right over the other ground. You know, the ship's a death trap, right? I'll get my time loop, because otherwise I'd be super dead. I'll pop out from my ship directly enough sun. Exciting dream, did you? It's not exactly impossible for all pilots to get too close to the sun, but it's not like it. I'll, I'll try to do it on purpose. We show the sun is in between your destination. We engage all pilots, you'll be fine. <laughs> right, really? That's funny. This totally goes faster. I didn't know this. That totally goes faster after like the first time you die. Alright. Where were all the planets? I guess I was on the other side of the sun. Is that what was up there? That's that's pretty fucking cool. Dark Bramble. Where's the other planets? There's a hall. That's where I want to go. What? Why does it point it down like that? I'm gonna try to get the. I'm getting farther away. What the fuck? Alright, fine. I want to try to get there without the autopilot, but it ain't working. So. Is this still not working? Wait, what the hell? Match velocity. Gauge autopilot. There it is. You're flying. Oh, not straight ahead. Uh, oh, I see. Got it. It's weird. It's a very weird feeling. Wait, so can I land that comment or no? Probably not, huh? What the hell's that? Is that water? Oh. Alright. <laughs> it worked fine. Everything's fine. Guessing there's not gonna be any oxygen for me here, is there? Just 
Should I, should I be making the ship's logs or is they just recaps? Or are they just recaps? Oh, the gravity's almost normal here. Flashlights. Should I have landed much closer? Nearby. Right nearby. There's a signal. Keep heading towards the uh Oh that's gonna eat my fuel, doesn't it? Oh it doesn't actually too much. Oh it's good for knowing where to go on points of interest. Okay. I'll I'll read it when I'm there next. Nothing here. Try to scratch my arm, but no, I don't have time. I definitely should have landed closer. I definitely do get a bit of like Subnautica vibes from this game. Is there a bunch on this planet, or is it mostly empty? Besides, I know the South Pole, but I'm guessing maybe the North Pole saw something. Ooh. Sakoi. I'm scared. Holy what the fuck? That's death. I can't I need to bring my if anything I can bring my ship down there. I'm not fucking going down there though. Good god, no thanks. Triggers are only for vertical movement. Uh, whoops. It's no. How do I get this thing? I get really unlucky or can I only get through the top? Oh shit, I lost my booster. Huh? huh? What's the point of this? Now, is this on this planet? Is that my fucking ship? Wait, what? No, this is another ship. This ain't mine. Oh, I see. Now this makes more sense. This is not my ship. Well, uh, I hope these people have some uh, delicious, delicious oxygen. <laughs> yeah, I did. I put the ship down safely. I'm in that. Sh um, in that ship. Um, in that. The ship went down. I didn't sustain bodily harm. A few minor repairs, and it's like the ship never got hit by those rocks. One of my better attempts, Feld Sparrow, would barely have laughed at me, I bet. That's good news, bad news. I uh, haven't found a way inside the structure yet. The door is broken, and, and I'm no, and I'm not great at exploring. But I think, but I think I would have had found different entrance by now if there was one, probably. I didn't get inside from here, but I know there's a passable surface. I'm going to head north. Head north to the ruins on the equator and find a way down there. Was that where I just was, Luca? With, with the uh, with the thing that went down. All right, I need to go back to my ship like now. <laughs> ship. I think, honestly, I think I'm gonna die before I reach my ship, but who knows? Equator, eh? Equator. No, that was just a hole? Really?
So I'm gonna go down here. Should I do it? <laughs> Death! Death! Is that a black hole? Holy shit, it's a black hole! I can't get up there. Death! Death! Huh? What the fuck? I'm still alive? Oh, a white hole, I see. Roll. Left, left button, hold, and on. Well, I'm fucked. Uh, all right, let's go on my ship. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! This sucks. Oof! I want to suffocate. Oh, bro, this that stinks. This is this is making me mildly uncomfortable. Suffocation. Suffocation. Oh, I hate it. Okay, that was as bad. As, that was as stressful as like say the Sonic drowning music. Woo! Oh, watch this again. Yeah, yeah, I know. We're going back in time. It's fine. We should go back time. Okay. Oh. I breathe hard because I suffocate, I see. Wait, do you have a unique line for me dying because of a black hole? Yeah, okay, when it's time I was gonna be super dead. Then you're lucky I don't I don't have you ground for medical reasons, because I have no idea what you're talking about. Whee. Whee. Alright, let's go back. Mm, I guess we'll go around the equator and there's an entrance to the planet there, I guess. Although there was some cool stuff I saw on the hole I went into. Lift off, lift off, lift off. Yes, that one. Ah! Bruh. Oh, oh spaghetti. Oh, I see. Uh, okay, uh, let's go back. And I should go fully to space first. Got it. <laughs> Whoops. Last uh, so I got a pilot. Ooh, there's some dark clouds outside. It is going to rain, it is going to pour. Alright, fuck actually landing this. I'm gonna. Oh, I can't even see the equator, can I? So, alright, so what is that? Is that. What is this? Perfect. I mean, that moment of time loop was like, who cares? That's fine. Where are we? Hey, pretty close. Wait, where was the thing I just saw? I got disorientated. Over here. Holy shit, that scared me a little bit. But not enough to actually react to it. All right, trying to figure they discovered quantum fluctuations. The screens of the dam have been found. <laughs> what is this? Oh. Can we 
like get inside of it somehow. You never found this place, really? Okay, so uh, so that means I don't ever need to be in here. Damn it! Can I do anything with this, or is that it? Oh. Wait, is there more? No way. Is this on this planet? I don't know. 291 meters? That sounds right. But, I mean, this world is extremely small, so... Oh, they went down? I'm going down. Shop. No clue where this is going to lead me. Wait, so did you even know about this place, Luca? Fuck I'm looking at dude. I have no clue. Retrieve. Is that me or the thing? I thought I can like control these, can't I? The scouts. How do I like how do I make them fly? That ain't working. Yeah, but I only went there like one time. That's Translates again. Old oh, RB, I got you. Sun Observatory, 550 meters. Entrance, Tower of Quantum Knowledge, below 90 meters. Head below, so let's go down. Glad they let you control the elevator from here, too. Very nice game. Very nice indeed. What is this? What the hell is this? Yep. Yep. Oh. Uh, be welcome. And be welcome in this place. Above you stands a tower of quantum knowledge. If you are making your first... Bells? With Tom Nook? Um, your first pilgrimage to the quantum moon. Ascend these stairs and obtain your last of the knowledge you need for your journey. I'll go in here instead. What the hell? Cool. Can I get some oxygen though soon? I'm getting real worried about that. The crosswords. Hey, Shenda Tower! Huh? Oh, wait. Isn't this the thing I can walk on? Huh? What? Uh oh. What the fuck am I supposed to do with this? I don't know, dude. Uh, it looks like the thing we saw on the moon. Now what? <laughs> I don't know why I need that information. Oh, fuck! I mean that. Can't do anything with this. Oh man. I have no clue. Stationary cam. Okay, it's good to know. Can I get over there with using my my fuel? Oh fuck. Nope. Not a chance that's happening. We're only way low on oxygen, so that's a bit worrisome. Let's go this way, I guess. Seems integrity 50%. I don't know what that means either, really. Okay. What is 
the point of this? Pit stop. Oh, what a nothing! Yay! I just realized it's probably just more. It's probably better worth to just die, right? Instead of go back to the ship and come back. That's good news. Where are you at, buddy? Hey! Alright, Mr. Krabs! Oh, you launched. That's great. Good job. You? Well, I guess that means I've been out here for a while, huh? Well, um, this is Bristle Hollow, but you probably knew that. Lots of history here. It's great. What are you doing here? Uh, I'm here to see the Hanging City. Uh, I've always, it's always been my dream to see with my own four eyes ever since I was a hatchling. An alien race lived in the solar system a long before a species even existed. How could I not want to see some civilization be like only? You've probably heard of the other seer, right? I'm afraid of space. Seriously, I'm more surprised than anyone about here. Do you know how I got this far? I fell. Chipped over our gravity crystal. It's dumb luck. I landed somewhere my little scout says is halfway stable instead of being sucked into what's below. I've been gauging the stability of the ground around me, and I'm using my little scout. This seems to be the place with the best surface integrity, so I'm just going to stay here until I'm ready to move. But... That's some of my problems. You didn't come all the way to listen to me bother, did you? Hey, yeah, that, yeah. I learned something. Oh, cool. Um, what is that? Actually, never mind. Okay, if you feel... If you find something about the new Nomi, though, I'd love to hear it. Um, if you don't mind, I mean. Or should I explore here? Oh, wow. Or should you explore? Um, not the black hole, actually. That's very... No. Uh, which, unfort which is unfortunate because um, most exciting stuff is below the crust, including the Hang City. That's just to the north. You could actually see it from here. There's also a big dome on the south pole called the Salmon Observatory. You can't get to it from the inside. Trust me, I tried. Uh, but if but if it's like the rest of the Nome structures here, that's probably a path to it beneath the crust somehow. So I'm exploring. Um, if you know anything about Nome, I'd love to hear if you have too much trouble. Me, I'm an archaeologist. Remember, I'm the archaeologist, I guess, seeing as I'm Timberhurst got, got right now. All Timberhurst got. Um, Brittle Hollow is rich with... No May history, that's why I'm here. The planet is an absolute treasure of culture, history, and science. If you find any question about Bristol Hollow, No May, I'm your Herdian, or um, I have some knowledge of me, so maybe I can help. Okay. 27%. So, is that the Hanging City? That's awful. You're just here forever. What do you guys eat? There's not exactly a whole lot to eat here. No, eat there. What is this? This looks like something I could do later. Wait, what? Okay. Surprises. Forgot about this. Where do I go from here? Not here, apparently. Okay. Gravity can east 400 meters. Okay. Dude, stop playing the four the same dang four notes over and over again. Mm, oh me. Alright, well that was deeply unpleasant. Maybe that's far though. Guess that's the part to focus on. If not, I'll eventually get back up to that path. But wow, this place sure is something. It looks like the Hang City is north from here. You see the gravity can. I definitely want to see that. So I think I'm detecting oxygen from here, from somewhere below, which is nice, because I use lots of my spice cooking on top of my lungs from the surface. As soon as I stop driving, I'm going to head farther down below to fill up my tank. Fill up my tank, fill up my tank, fill up my tank, fill up my tank, fill up my tank. Fill up my tank. So it's like a hub, I guess? Hang City, no 200 meters. But I can't reach that, right? So I guess a gravity cannon? So this is... Wait. So is this north? I'm confused as to what the hell these guys don't, don't forget to identify. How do I do that? Is that this? I don't know what, you, I don't know what identifying means. Itch attack. T 
Wait, did it just pull us automatically? Is there something here? Oh no, I hit RB. Well, I'm glad I went down this path. I just kind of randomly went down this, although it was to this end too. Is there bricks falling? Man, I have no idea what's going on. That's when you're on death by signal and try to signal scope on it. Unknown. How's that unknown? I know what that is. I don't know. So far, I'm honestly not too. Like, I was intrigued at first. I'm not. Don't know if I'm really enjoying this so far. It's okay. But. I don't know. I feel like as I've gotten older, I kind of care less and less about, like, doing puzzles and games I don't, like, really like. Like, throw me a pause on a Zelda game. Hell yeah, I'll do that shit any day. But, like, this, it's... Uh oh I don't want to do that. But, like, this, it's like... I don't want to do puzzles in this, man. I just want to... That's like a walking simulator. Just let me walk and... and do whatever, but... I don't know. Like, this hasn't really been intriguing me so far. I hope it does. I'll go forge control. But then also, there's so many, like, different things. It's like, I don't even know where to go. It's like, it's super overwhelming. That's exactly what Vinny said. Really? That's interesting. Wait, what part? That's fascinating. Uh, requires a powerful, highly advanced warp core. Sh how should we obtain the Ash Twin Project? Alright, well, I mean, if Vinny said that, and this eventually turned to a really good game for him, I'll, I guess I'll, uh, I'll lose the word for it. But yeah, I have no fucking clue what I'm doing right now, man. I'm just kind of wandering around, and there's so many branching paths, and I just have no clue where the hell to go. Oh, good thing those trees. Um, do I gotta worry about saving or anything? I'm gonna probably end stream soon here. You get crap the new advanced warp coil button, in spite of us. Also, I think I think how you read these is I like I go up the spiral, so this one's first, so I'll do this one first, right? Banning the vessel's warp core in its casing, it means losing valuable knowledge. This is true. However, it's knowledge we have little hope of recovering. It would be best to relearn, I think. The greatest challenge here, I think, is we don't have the design for such a powerful core or any of the original crafters of the vessel's core. Oh, I missed that. No, but Poke was... <laughs> was apprenticed to Anona, who created the original design, and our black hole forge is adept at creating simple cores. I believe I could be of use here. The vessel's warp core was created before my time, but Anona uh, might explain his designs to me. This is the safety path for our clan. Safest path for our clan. This is the safest path, the best one. Our goal is worth the risk. Is it though we've that's a very small spiral for that much text uh, is it though we've tried for so long to find something that i and others now believe might be impossible to find if we search for the eye um is a futile one we should choose the option with the least potential oh cool behold that it, it scrolls like that that's interesting oh i would very much like to craft such a powerful core more re re more rel Relevantly, I believe the back hole forge crew and I can recreate a basic design. Cool. Alright, I'm guessing there's another scroll somewhere. Considering what's going on. I'm considering there's another slot. Slot? Slot. So I got the first one. Oh, there it is. <gasps> Skellies. All right, well, oh shit, am I stuck? Oh, thank God. Where the hell am I? Help! What the fuck? What? Shop scroll. Oh, I remember walking down that staircase. First few, first few stream sales, do sure. Um, but then he really liked it. Ship log helps, so I'll keep in track of everything. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. 
You could retrieve the warp core from the vessel. To require a, a return to Dark Bramble Plume, my father said the many good Nome perish there. A mentor, Coleus, and his old mentor once discovered and studied an angler fish fossil at Ember Twin. Use that knowledge to avoid the angler fish entirely. <sighs> I remember the angler fish fossil we used to play in Fossil Fish Cave when we were children. What Mallory and I learned from the fossil would that theoretically help us evade the anglerfish, but our hypothesis was never tested on a live specimen. The vessel's warp core is broken, and at best I recall uh, that those um, present when the vessel crash said it uh, sustained lethal inches. <laughs> Interesting, when you hold LR, it actually, um, or, or LZ, or it actually continues time, versus if you don't, nothing happens. Perhaps we could still repair it. My grandmother told me there's there's little time to assess nature to extend the damage. If it no longer functions, an old core could be valuable blueprint if I were able to transfer it back here. Yeah, this is all like going through one ear out the other. You know, like when a teacher sometimes like, hey, pay attention, what did I just say? And the kid's like, oh, 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 I don't know. That's exactly how I feel right now. I'm reading it, but I'm not like I'm not absorbing any of this. Which is a shame, but. there okay that happened to me too okay what am i getting stuck on there's like an invisible wall what the fuck oh my god come on i'm stuck now oh my god i'm actually stuck Whee! uh I feel strange trying to recreate an Ono's warp core without him. At times, it still feels strange to no longer be his very young apprentice and for the black hole forge to be in, in any care, not his. Hypothesis. This will always feel strange. Even though my time with them was short, I miss my old mentor deep, deeply. I have a chance. I have the chance to try. To have the chance to try is thrilling. But I don't want to disappoint anyone. I think I could do this probably. But what if excitement has clouded assessment of my own abilities? Was I wrong in volunteering to build it? I was born in the star system and never saw Nona's warp core with my own three eyes. I don't know what he taught me. What if it had been off a larger portion I could consume? Oops. I almost missed that. Still, all I could give is my best. And as Anona would say, should my best proven sufficient then we could find another way to achieve what's needed i have clary and root in the forge i'm on clan i'm not alone that's cool those are like dna sequences bones bone bone bones bone 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 bones uh hardcore parkour time bam 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 really Bam, 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 bam. Huh. Am I stuck again? There we go. There we go. Squiggles! A button to boost? Yeah, I was trying that. Okay, don't know what I'm seeing, but alright. Is there a good stopping point anytime soon? I don't really just want to die and have to redo all this, you know? Like, I'm getting stuck on the stair, dude! I'm getting stuck on the top stair! It's kind of like strafe up the stairs, that's probably why I'm having issues. Oh god, where do I go now? Just lead to nothing. What the hell, dude? Can I like, leave a checkpoint or something? Oh, someone there. I'm not gonna be able to find that again. That's for damn sure. No. I don't want to waste too much fuel. He says he boosts. 
I'll show kind of long. Oh, if I remember where that is. Wait, does it, will it remember for me? I don't think it does. Does it? If it remembers for me, that's wonderful, but I'm uh, kind of guessing it doesn't. Nah, all right. Well, there's no way we remember where that is. There's nothing here. Oh, there is. Has anyone observed the phantom moon that sometimes greets us in the night sky? Your thoughts interest me. I compliment your eyes. How do you imagine it disappears? How about this could it shift in the light spectrum? Suppose this moon is too shy to show us its face. I'm interested in your playful moon. Is it much like its violent friend, Hollow's Lantern? The moon isn't volcanic to my unaided eyes. Sometimes it leaves its friend's Hollow Lantern for a night time. The nights the moon circles this planet appear random. It seems to travel as it likes. Imagine if there are two volcanic moons. Then I imagine there would be none of us left. Ha <laughs> ha Hypothesis. There could exist too much lava. I certainly prefer we test the null hypothesis. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> And the game saves when you die. Okay. So it's maybe die on purpose when I want to stop playing. No! Really? We didn't hear that? <laughs> that meter hit the planet? This is some shit Terraria music right here. Expect to see that. Fence bars spare jet fuel. It's annoying to sh slope around the planet. If, if I can't use my jetpacks, I'm leaving us here. I check with my little scouts. I do, I do too use it. Hornfells, you burnt marshmallow, and the scouts' integrity reading has said this piece of brittle hollow is as stable as any. But who knows? If fuel's still around, feel free to use it. If not, well, you're reading this. No, I'm sure you got bigger problems. Okay, <laughs> I had to do it. The hanging city below 50 meters. What's that? What's that? So our friends on Brittle Hollow, I just warped here from White Hole Station on the other side of our Brittle Hollow Black Hole. Our design worked. We successfully recreated warp travel. Cool. I don't know how close it is to, to Anona's original design. What the fuck is go what the fuck is going on? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Ah! Okay, well, I guess I don't get to prove what the rest of that was. What the fuck was that? Well, I guess I got a stopping point. Did the sun explode? <laughs> Was that the moon we were reading about? Does that just happen at a certain time? Do I only have X amount of time to explore before something like that happens? That looked like the white hole. Do you see anything new? The sun is going super. Oh, so the sun does go supernova. But yeah, observatory has an exhibit about that. Between me, I gloss over some of the finer details. Astrophysics is really more Hornfell's domain. Me, I'm here for the rocket science and the marshmallows. Cool. So like, as you die, you can, you know, the dumber ways you die, you get like, cool things to say with them. That's fun. All right. Well, I guess now's a good time as any to uh, quit game. That was fun. Um, I'm intrigued. Uh, I guess I'll I, I'll keep playing this. I'll see where this goes. 
I don't know how to feel. <laughs> so I guess, okay, so it goes Supernova, so we know for sure we only have a certain amount of time limit each time to find shit, which is interesting. Um, thank you so much for watching. The beginning is very slow. Is this still the beginning? I thought the beginning ended once I le left off the planet. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll continue this.